Assuming you have a dual camera iPhone, switch to portrait mode and snap your picture. In Photoshop, go to Open, scroll down and select your photos. Right down at the bottom you'll see what appears to be the image you want to use. But when you open it, you'll see that it's a JPEG image and not the HEIC image you want to work with. So close it and go to open again. This time it'll show you the location of the file you just opened. So use Command and the up arrow to go up and keep pressing Command and up until you can see the Masters folder. Open that, go to the current year and the month and the date and in the top folder you'll see the image you want to work with. And you can see it's an HEIC image and when you look at the channels you can see it has a depth map. Go to Filter, Blur and choose Lens Blur. You can change the focus by dragging the Blur Focal Distance slider. You have to guess at this, so just drag it to where the focus looks right. I found that a setting of 125 for this particular image has the bust of Schubert on the left in focus and the rest blurred out. Let's increase the amount of that blur for a stronger effect. If we drag the Blur Focal Distance slider further to the right, we find the bust of Mephistopheles at the back is now in focus and the foreground, including Schubert, is blurred out. When you're done, hit OK. And that's how, for the first time, you can change the focus of a photograph after you've taken it. If you've enjoyed this tutorial, please subscribe to this channel.